Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Animal Crossing at Fort Whimsy. Okay, so look at the map. Just look at the map. Hi, Sam here. L but look at the map. Can you see the flatness of that map? That is one flat map. I think by the time you've seen this, I have uploaded my two extensive videos of me demolishing this island. I just thought somebody might want to see it and if I have to suffer you have to suffer with me but there you go this is the outcome we've got two green hills with snowmen on the top that hopefully given another two days would have melted but other than that it's flat look at those poor bridges doing absolutely nothing um, I'm gonna keep those two bridges those were the I never did an incline and those were the only two bridges we did so we haven't actually wasted any money Generally trying to get to three stars, I waste a load of money just putting inclines in everywhere and then have to demolish them all, which gives an extra day before we can redo it. <sighs> but at least there, here, we can move a house and put an incline or a bridge wherever we want, which I think is pretty good. But what we're doing, if you look at the top right hand corner of that map, I've moved one house. That's Benjamin's house. And I'll show you Benjamin's house. We're also going to move Raddle's house. And we're going to be building that area into a little school area. And I'll, I'll show you why in a minute. But first job, obviously, we have to get our dailies outfit. Hey, Mabes. Hey, Sabes. Right, let's go bother. Let's go bother Sable. She's almost my friend. Oh, 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 she spoke to me. She spoke to me. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. She's speaking to me. She's speaking. Yes, my God, Sable. Leave her uh, Mabel, leave her alone. Oh, she likes me. Oh, she wants to offer me a cup of tea. Oh, Christmassy. But there you go. We're almost there. Oh, crowny. I do have enough money for the crown, but I'm saving it for moving things and buying inclines. We've got to be sensible. I also have a room for the turnips again. Oh, the turnip fun. Right. If you can hear music in the background, I do apologise. There's this guy. I think I said it before, actually. He comes because there's a park next to me. And he comes to the park, he opens his car door, blasts his music while he does, does his exercises. Oh, I like them. And um, bless him for, for, for having a go, but it's not really what you want to hear. You know, sometimes he plays good music, it's like, okay. But other times it's just boom, 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 boom. It's like, oh, really? I can't see anything other than the boots, really. I quite like this. This will be nice and warm. I'm still trying to figure out her colour, you know? What kind of, what kind of colours are we going for? I'm sort of drawn to the naturey browns and oranges for this time of year. Um, got a white jeans, black jeans. I might get a black jeans just so she's got, her in a, got them in her wardrobe, you know? You need a nice array of stuff in that capsule wardrobe. <clears throat> I know what I'm talking about. Let's get her some more socks. Some blue blue crochet socks and now I've done that do I want the same colour boots do I have these boots I don't think I do oh those ones sort of dark brown yes okay is there another hat I do like her bobble hat I mean it's a bit arty no I'm not too keen oh she could have a tulip hat Oh, she looks quite cute in the tulip hat because I think it's a little sunny today. So we'll get her a tulip hat. There you go. Yes, I want to wear my new outfit. Who wouldn't want to wear this outfit? And it really shows off my snowflake pochette, which I'm very proud of my snowflake pochette. Look at my snowflake pochette. Right, let's get this. And then I shall uh, run around and show you what I've done so far. I've done a bit of pathing, paving, paving. I've done some path. Which, oh, there's another one. Oh, exciting. What did I get? Oh, yeah, dream house. I only, I've, I've been updating my house when I run out of storage. Basically, that's been my thing. When I can't store things anymore. She is an attentive shop person. Aha! Right. Bye, Mabes. Bye, Sabes. So, okay, updated my house to get more storage. I've 
I moved like all the white, not all, but some white and red flowers over here because tomorrow, oh, I've got to count my trees as well. Got to count my trees. You need 28 of these and 10 of the other. So two, four, six, ooh, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Is this fun? 26. Oh, I've got 28, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. So because I put everything on this little corner of the island, this bit is quite, oh, you're still there. Hello, hi Kelly. This bit is quite nicely built up. Oh, hi Bo. How are you? Mornings are neat. You're right, he's happy, look at his face. He's just a happy fella. He's just a happy little fella. Anyway, right, let's go to the services because I built, look, my Christmassy, my Christmassy thing, look at this. Or oh, Benjamin's home, good. I've got loads of stuff that I now need to empty my pockets and pick up. I've got the, I know these are toadstooly, but I think they kind of they kind of match. And I've got this path with these baubles and it's so adorable. So I'll show you Benjamin's house and tell you why we're doing a school area. So here is Benjamin's house. He's a little is he the school teacher? Or is he just really into school stuff? I'm, I'm going to say he's he's a school teacher. And we're going to do a painting of what looks like Miss Piggy, which is lovely. And he is like a, a primary or infant school teacher. Or is it elementary in America? I don't know. But that's what I'm thinking it is. So this is like the primary school. I'll say hello to Benjamin who will go doo -doo -doo at me. Hi, Benjamin. I can't stop yawning today. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, I'm a bit sleepy, actually. Uh, what? Nine in the morning? <laughs> oh, dear. But yes, right. So we have one school there. Bye, Benjamin. Okay, he's grown on me. He's quite sweet. And then we're going to move Rattle's house over here. Because on my other island, I kind of thought he was like a doctor. And he could be a doctor. But for our purposes, I'll show you the house when I get there. Oh, they're saying hi to each other. Oh my god, that's so cute. So this is Raddle's house. Luckily, he's home too. And I'm thinking... Oh, DIY time. I'm thinking science teacher, which is more, you know, secondary school. Or is it high school? What's the posh word for, like, you know, over 11 goes to in America? I don't know. What are you doing, Raddle? An orange end table. Well, that's nice, but... Can I have some of the, you know, seasonal stuff? Yeah, go on, teach me. So, oh, oh my God, he's teaching me and he's a teacher. Wow. So, yes, I'm going with um, chemistry teacher because, yeah, you know, you sit here and this is, you sit here, you sit here, you pretend to sit there and this is like the teacher's desk and he's got chemistry. So, I, I, I think that's right. I think that's okay. Bye. So that is our plan. We're going to do... Blimey, I've got so much stuff. Okay, I need to empty my pockets now that I've, I've got more space. So I'm going to empty my pockets, uh, check for anything else, and then pick up everything else, and we'll start making our school. Right, I've picked up a load of stuff. Still a load of stuff over there. And the uh, exercising man over there is now playing Mr. Loverman quite loud. So I'm going to stop recording and play it back and see if you can hear that. Because I get a feeling I'm, I'm copyright claiming, I don't know, it's not like I'm making any money. But will they get me for that if someone in like the park opposite me is playing Mr. Loverman? I don't know. So I've played it back. And I can't hear it on the recording, so we're just gonna we're just gonna get on with it basically. So, right over here, I kind of want like an outdoor. Oh, better get my uh, better get my special hat on. I want like an outdoor teaching play area. Um, so I normally, if I'm gonna do like an outdoor outdoor area, I'll use the wood paving because it kind of looks. I want to move this tree now. I've gone and put it there. Um, because it's right in my way. I'm going to move this tree. Do I have anything to move this tree? I'd have to cut down this tree. Oh, the agonies. Oh, well, I can plant more. 
going to be precious with trees. Oh, of course I can't put anything in my pockets. Right, let's drop over here what we're going to be using for the elementary school. So over here I want like an outdoor... Um, oh, the destinations thingy. I want to put that somewhere if I can find anywhere. Um, maybe... Because we'll have another path probably coming from here. So we could put that here, couldn't we? Uh... Okay, not not. Cool. Let's stop attacking things with a uh, with your axe, please. This is so annoying. This thing, I really like it, but it's like there's nothing written on it. Look, oh, there is. Right, that's better. <laughs> that makes more sense. So if you're coming from this direction, you have no idea what you're doing until you come around here. But it looks really good. But it's just so weird. It's huge. Look, it takes up. I can't even figure out. Is it like? four spaces it takes up it's ridiculously huge i think it's more like nine but anyway so we'll put that there and over here we want all the elementary school stuff so i think maybe no we'll keep the cute diy we'll put the um to place things so we can see what we're doing that might be sensible take a bit longer but oh well so i thought this might be good just sort of in the corner like you know supplies we'll see how that looks anyway um, some zen cushions, all the dollies and stuff. Obviously this is for, um, I don't think the pet bed. Or I might have a, a dog. I want a petting zoo area. That would be so cute. A uh, mug for the teacher. We'll have a mug for the teacher. There you go. <laughs> you, you need your coffee. Um, a cassette player, just so we can play some music in this area. Homework set. Yes, I just got given that by, who gave me that? I think Sydney gave me that this morning, so that was nice. Um, basic teacher's desk, you go there, you will, thank you very much. Completely blocking the oh-so-important bridge, but I'm sure, I'm sure they'll live. Uh, zen cushions, zen cushions, baby chair, street organ, water cooler, this can go here. Well, not here, but you know, in this area. Puppy plushy microscope. Got to have the microscope. Bit of science going on. You want a bit of science in your schools? Um, let me put the RC helicopter here because it's a bit more of a grown-up toy, you know? Some floor lamps. Chalkboard can go here. Because, you know, teaching. So outside the little school, we'll just have fun. And outside this school, we're having learning. Because we do have a baby. We do have a baby. I don't think we'll bother with the, um... Oops. Uh, with the candy machine. I don't think that's very sensible in school, but... Ah, well. So, yes, we have Callie, who has a little baby. Who is adorable. So this whole area is for that baby. Um, I might leave this here for now, just to, just to see ideally we'd have some sand down here but would you you would see it wouldn't you of course you would so we put some sand down like a sand play area because yeah you, that'd be all right we should the um i mean i could dig that up oh no i can't put a tree on i can put i could put the sand all the way around and put a bit of um Oh, the path coming yeah that'd be all right yeah that'd be okay uh, i might make some hedges or something actually to go around this to sort of cordon off the school area that might look cute i can't remember what he's playing now out there i think it's is that the same song that's a long song it's when all you can hear is boom 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 boom, boom. it's it's quite off-putting i'm just saying Anyone who blasts music, it's quite off-putting. Um, right, so we'll just do this with the corners, because, oops, I think it looks nice. Oh, this is, I love that path. Please, please remember to put the MA code somewhere, Sam, because it's such a cute little path. Uh, right, so I think we have a sandbox. We do. So sandbox first, of course. Yay! Right, put that down. Oh, this is looking, looks so cute. 
and just a line of toys a whole line of toys oh we could have a little uh, teddy bears picnic as well oh i've got a picnic thingy and a baby organ and a tricycle right let's put the dolly you're terrifying but that's okay and do we have a little baby panda thought we did now check what we've got over here actually quick I think I've overdone it again with all the things that I've got but um I'll be fine right baby panda so they're having a little, a little chat there which is adorable and slightly weird but we're just going to ignore the weirdness and well, we got the puppy but we might put the puppy over there I've got this might be a nice area for like like a, an you know outdoor indoor area so this is this is like a, another classroom type of thing don't want to go too mad but we do have the entire map have you ever emptied your island and run from one side to the other it's actually quite big and really weird you're just in this expanse of ice or desert whichever way you've done it so we've got our outdoor play area and our outdoor stroke indoor fun area there we go maybe protruding a little bit we'll protrude a little do we want to protrude anymore i don't think we do i do want to make some fences what would be good fence uh oh i've got that I need tons of books and I ten books for that, but that's a that's a cutie. But we're doing outside right now. What fence do I want? I mean <laughs> you could do the barbed wire. Uh this one is quite schooly, I think. I think that one's quite schooly, the vertical board fence. What do you need for that? Loads of wood. I've got wood. Or we could go, I don't think the stone really. Maybe the brick. What look what what colour? Yeah, this is kind of clapperboardish. That's just a really interesting house he's got. Hmm. So either the vertical fencing, or that's all I've got. Right. Okay. <laughs> My choices are numbered. I do have the. I have the hedge. Do I have the hedge? I thought I got the hedge uh, DIY. I could have sworn I did. I'm going to cry if I haven't. Huh. Interesting. I've got some, I think. Was it my other character that got it? And I'm waiting for Leaf one more time. My other character got it. I need Leaf to come one more time. That was it. Okay, panic over. We're going to go for the vertical fencing. Back in a bit. Everything stops for balloons. What I get, what I get, what I get, what I get. Please, something good for this area. A toilet cleaning set. Well, that's my life, really. Okay, I'm back. Now, we have a mixture of the vertical board fencing and the picket fencing, because I think that looked quite nice. So I'm, I'm going to put it behind the house. I know it's a bit weird. I know you can't see it, but I know it's there. OK, I know that it's there and it bothers me. And I recognise how silly that is. But th this looks, you know, this matches the house quite nicely. And you, you want them contained. You know, you want children contained. You don't want them lollygagging around, really, do you? Can I, can I pick those up without... They're going to annoy me if I pick them up. I um, don't know if this is big enough, really. But oh, he's playing hes playing something else down. I swear he's turned the sound up outside. Do I like that? I don't think I like that. I don't like it. I don't like it. Not the fence. I don't like it being sort of on the, on the, uh, the wood like that. So I'm going to do something else. So I put the dirt, the light dirt path underneath, just because it looks. It, I don't know if I like it with the snow now, but it's what I've done. So I've done it. This is what I always used to do under under the fencing. It just looked like, 
you know, grass and that wouldn't grow up to the fencing was the idea. Snow would, I'm thinking of that now, but um, grass would sort of, you'd have a space generally. So, um, we'll, we'll do, let's see if this looks right. May have to put another one in. Yeah, I may have to put it here as well. Not there. 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 Yeah, I think that looks, okay. looks okay. And it's like this. This is a, the entrance. Oh. Oh, go on. <laughs> oh, that's heartbreaking. No. Oh. Um. Okay, another plan. Right, we'll have another go. Simple wood fencing will now go here. No, there's always one. There's always one that goes completely not where I meant it to go. Every time, just every time. Oh, that's a lot of snowflakes. I could be catching those snowflakes. About time not. Right. And then we'll go back to the vertical fencing. There. Oh, it looks nice. So you've got the school entrance. This is an extra. We'll make this one bigger now. We've incorporated our little stump there. That's somewhere for them to sit. It's an extra place. You've got to think about them bugs as well, especially seeing I'm just starting. It's still on my mind to get my, my museum done. Do I want this to extend out, maybe? So it's good to leave some stumps around so you can catch, catch them bugs, but, you know, you don't want to... Uh, You don't want to just like have a stump sort of just sitting there. It means something. Look, you can sit there and, and watch the children play. Keep an eye on them. Make sure they don't eat anything they shouldn't, that kind of thing. Right, what have we got? Um, I might actually put a couple of tables in here. Or one table. Oh, I know what I want. School desk. I want that school chair. And then there's one thing that I've wanted, and I'm going to go and search for it, aren't I? This is it. The modelling clay. Oh, come along now. Just come along now. Right. Let's just, just drop these, because there's no reason for me holding them, because I don't need them. So stop being precious about your tools. I'll keep the slingshot. You know, I need my slingshot. Right, so we can have one one little um, table in here for the, the purposes of modelling clay. There you go, little school desk. It's got a little pouch on it as well. Let's keep all their things in. Little chair. I will just move this round to put the modelling clay on because there's no moving things around once you put it down outside. Look! How cute is that? They can model. I wonder if you can um, customise the, the clay. I don't know. Hmm. I might have a go later. Um, right, what else do we want here? Got a little... Oh, we could have like indoor toys. Like the robot and stuff. Because you don't really want like a, a robot outside. Because it'll, it'll get... Uh, It'll get wet. You don't want that. So, got a bamboo bench, which might be nice for putting things on, rather than having everything on the floor. The tricycle for outside, and then another. Oh, oh we got the gym actually. We got a huge playground gym that you can sit on, and sometimes you catch them sitting on them, and it's absolutely adorable. Need to clean this area up. How close are we to the services? We're quite, quite close, actually. One thing I do want to keep an eye on is making sure that we can run all the way around the island. I'm going to pick that up because that's annoying. Um, 
so I want to make sure that there is some form of path it, it can wiggle a bit but basically across the whole island so I want to bring this path sort of along here once I've moved those things and along maybe the back of this river so you have a nice river walk yes I know I did my snow I pushed the wrong bit I didn't mean to push the wrong bit but the body ended up on the head okay don't judge me anyway so that's my plan just to have so I know playing wise I can run from one end to the other um, also kind of want to incorporate oh blimey the river here maybe we could have a nice little pond here and do the other river joining that river because I don't want I want some form of river because you know it's a river and you need it for fish and stuff and all the rest of it so you know got to be sensible so there's there's all my plans look you can sit on it uh, yeah, I think I think we'll bring this and incorporate this bit. Just just have a nice river area here. Obviously, the um, we'll be moving the museum. I haven't figured out where. I haven't figured all this out yet. Okay, I'm still going, but hopefully we will. Back to this though. I'm going all over the place. So doll's house, I think maybe indoors. Can you put it on this? That might be cute. Oh, you can. Can you put it on the edge though? rather than taking up the whole the whole bench yes turning it on yay I love the doll's house I know it doesn't do much but I do love the doll's house um, or oh, a clacker cart out here I think sort of nonchalantly on the edge there perfect look it goes it goes it works oh dear I'm such a child. I love finding something that does something that I didn't realise it did anything. Just sort of coming across it and going, oh my lord, it does that. I love that. Um, right. I kind of want... Let's move this. We can move this off the sand, actually, because it's sand itself. So it doesn't necessarily need to be on the sand, but we'll put it sort of there-ish. And then, do I have room for the kids' tent here? Was that weird? You can no, you can still you can still get in. That's okay. And then these two, because unfortunately you can't sit in the t in the kids' tent, which is a shame. But there you go. And you sort of here, you lot can be having a little discussion around there. You can't get through here now. I might I might save the sandbox. Maybe they can have a sandbox. Why can't they play the sandbox? Is that a balloon? Is that a balloon? There's a balloon somewhere. I can hear you. Come to me, balloon. Oh, it's, it might be money. I'm not going to say no to money, but I'd rather have a DIY, please. Please give me a DIY. Oh, a layered tank. Well, it'd be very pretty for summertime, so I'm not going to complain. Uh, so, what's I going to put here? I've got a mama bear. Might put the mama bear, bear here, because that would be adorable. If I can find it. Got another dolly. Where are you, mama bear? Mama bear. There we go. You go over one, and then we'll have another dolly. Hopefully a different colour. Can't remember what I've got. Oh, she's a red one as well, that's alright. There you go, you, you lot are having a discussion and, and you're sort of... You're not being paid attention to, are you? Oh dear. There we are. That, that, looks, that looks like a more of a conversational area, don't you think? Anyway, um, oh, I do get carried away. Right, we want... I just saw the baby chair. want that kind of there. That's cute. It's kind of a birthday one, isn't it? But I think that's cute. Happy. It's a happy chair, so that's fine. Uh, the kids, the street organ. It is backwards, though, if we put it there. I kind of want it there so you can see it. 
So let's move the clacker car in. Whee! Look, it's going, it's going, it's going. There we are. Um, move this back. Look, they move, they move, they move. They did move. Keep moving. And over a bit. So it's sort of pushed, it's being pushed out of the way just for now. You know, that sort of it's pushed out of the way bit. We'll put this up a bit just so you can. There's nothing worse than doing a really beautiful design, but you can't actually run around the thing. That that's don't care how pretty it is, it's annoying. Um, we put the pop-up book here. Shall we open the pop-up book? Yes, we're opening that pop-up book. What else have we got? How long have I been doing this? Absolutely ages. Right, let's put out the way the blinking bass. We've got another pop-up book. Oh, we've got a pile of Zen cushions. I thought would be quite good for um. You know, just sitting on the ground. This is the this is my Christmas design. It's terrible, isn't it? It's supposed to be like um. Oh, let's put that away because that's going to be annoying. It's supposed to be like a inside of like candy cane kind of thing. But um, yes, I recognise that it's it's not the greatest of designs. Fine. And then I think I've got just a Zen cushion there. Yes. Okay. Push you back a bit push you in. No, don't sit down. We haven't got time for sitting down. I haven't had my breakfast yet. So we've got those. Let's push you in over here, maybe. There. Let's set you off again. Uh, look, look, it's walking, it's walking. Um, got another pop-up book, which might be good to sort of laying... don't want to get in the way. Can this be pulled over at all? Can one? That means you can still get to the doll's house. And then the pop-up book, maybe closed version. You can still get past it, that's okay. There you go. Just so it's, it's been left there. Somebody's been reading it. It's never tidy at these places. Oh, the cute floor lamp. I kind of want that there now. Ah. Uh, Okay, pick you all up again. Pick you all up, fine. But these these are young looking, if that makes sense. I think they should fit. That should fit nicely in there. Uh, where did you all end up? Bamboo bench. And doll's house. Turning it on, of course, and the pop-up. No, I like these because they you can sit on them, but they're also really nice little tables, especially when you colour them. I like that. Okay, happy enough with that. We're getting there. So we've still got this sandbox. We've got the cute music player. That might be nice down here. And what music should we play? Just like, you know, story time area. Um, I mean, that makes the most sense, doesn't it? I wonder what um, I'm going to look up Benjamin's favourite song. Bet I haven't got it. His favourite song is Mr. KK, um, which no, I don't have. So we're going to leave it on lullaby until we get Mr. KK, and then we can put that for him. But that's not that's not going to send you mad at all. That's not music for inside a uh, scary place. Um, <laughs> words. Right, I want to put another one of these lamps somewhere. I kind of want it over here in this corner. Um, let's move everything over one so we can get a lamp in there. Stop sitting down when I'm trying to move stuff. Okay, everything gets picked up. Everything gets picked up. Right, where's the other cutesy lamp? So we'll put that there because wandering around at night it's nice to see you know all the all the lights on and we'll have this and this it pulled out a little bit there you go it's it's taking shape isn't it can you go back a little bit that's weird because you're like in a line now um Let's put you here. And what about 
the space one? Quite like that one. I think I prefer that. <laughs> Just leave that on. Oh, I've got a thing. What thing have I got? Oh, I popped a balloon. You are welcome. There we go. Right, so what else have we got? Because we've still got the other school to do. Um, oh, the cute DIY table. I thought it looked, it kind of matched. And it would be useful to have a little DIY table in. So let's pick this up. Let's put the DIY table here. Can I find it again? There we go. So, no, it's kind of, okay, there's a saw. The saw kind of ruins the look, but it's a toy saw, so you're okay. It's just a little toy saw, so that's all right, isn't it? Yeah. Let's put the baby chair here so they can sort of watch the, um, where are you? Watch the, uh, the organ thingy. Yeah, there you go. Lovely. Um, do you have to move this to make it work? You just wee. See, you're sitting there and you're watching this and it's great fun. Anyway. What else have we got? What else do I really want? Let's get these things out of the way. Maybe a pile of sun cushions here, just so, you know, the kids can can take stuff out and, you know, whenever they need to. Um, I may do the path coming up here because we seem to have come out a lot. And I kind of want another, let's push that in actually. Um, I want another line of, do I want to cordon this in or is that a bit too much? I mean, it's Animal Crossing, you don't really need to. I think that's a bit too much. I think that'd be okay. Maybe just a line around here of the simple wood fencing. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh, do you know what would be nice? A little bit of holly in. Right, let's go dig some random holly up. Because gold knows I've got a ton of random holly. Let's go get my shovel and dig us a load of holly up. So if we replace this one with a bit of holly. And this one with a bit of holly. Oops. No, don't, don't hit the thing with your shovel. That's never good. Just gives it a bit more. I, I am also recognising that Holly is very prickly and it's right next to a children's area. But again, it's Animal Crossing. It's fine. It's absolutely fine. Right, let's do... Should we do some of these? They're a bit garish, I know, but and I will eventually try and, and better the design. But um, I know, I quite like it. So we've got that sort of stepping area there, all around here. Is need maybe something in the middle, just sort of like you know, it's a kids' area, so they would have dropped stuff. Let's drop the um, pop up book there and this sturdy sewing box. I know it's a sewing box, but it's kind of cute, so it's like got, got cute things in it, just to add a bit more. We need a couple of flowers as well, so let's dig up some flowers, just go steal them. Oh, these, these are nice. Let's steal these. Just as you're watering them. Thanks, Carl. Carl has grown on me. Oh my god, I need to show you Carl's house at some point. It's awesome. He's like a rock musician. Hi, Carl. Bye, Carl. Alright, that'll do. Just a couple. I think that's all. I don't know if you can fit one in there. Nope, you can't. So it's going here. I uh, can't put one there, although I can put, um, I think, this one. There. Yes, yes, yes. And put a flower, the other flower here. Come on there. Let's go get a red one because it's Christmas. And they happen to be here. That's, that's not the reason. Hi oh, Kyle, are you sniffing a tree? You sniff that tree, right. Back around here. And put a little red flower there. 
Oh, it's lovely. Look at this. This is this is the kind of school you want to go to. Let's move that one over because that's going to be annoying. There we go. Right, the other one. <laughs> huh. Right, we need to move Raddle's house. I will do that a bit later on. Let's drop all of this stuff and pick up all the other stuff. So, Raddle's house there. This is a nice area. Oh, they can have a little beach all to themselves as well. I kind of want a path though going along here. From here. So this area may be kind of cutting down what we can do. Let, let's let's map it out with our our um, wooden flooring. Could move his house over one, but I want the fencing there. Do I? Yeah, yeah. No, this will this will do. Actually, I'm going to. Have you have you melted yet? You get. No, you have not. I need to get rid of you. Um, I want to put Raddle's house back here, which is annoying because this is here and I can't move. Can I move a snowman? I can't move a snowman, can I? That's a shame. Um, make sure you put your snowmen where you want them to be for four whole days because if I move it up, in fact, if I actually, no, I'll move it up a couple but then I don't need this path to go all the way in and we can do the wooden floor like you walk through the wooden floor to get there, that makes sense. So we'll move it back one, two. Prob um, can I move it there? I'm gonna go see. I'm gonna go see where I can actually put it first. I've got Raddle's house. I'm not gonna place it yet. I just wanna see how far back we can get with that sodding snowman in the way. So we can go there. So we can move back all the way to there and then make the school out the front rather than to the side. I think that'd be okay. And then we can still have pathway coming from the bridge. Although you might not need, you might just have a pathway going in there. That's an idea. Hmm, okay, there's lots of things to think about here. I'm going to put his house back there though, but maybe we could have a fence because you can just run across the beach. It's like, you know, not that much to get to. We've got the peninsula, but that can be reached from behind. I think we want that bit, bit bigger because that's a bit of a tight squeeze. So we'll go, that's going back one. We'll go one more. So we'll do all the same again up here. Go. that looks a bit better doesn't it so you you're just basically coming off here or you're going to the school so we'll do another one that reaches to here and then that will go around there oh blimey right okay i think i'll use this little one though not yet oh, oh i hear a balloon i hear a balloon i hear a balloon or oh, maybe these ones these ones are adorable Balloon is definitely there. Right, balloon time, balloon time. Oh, you're over there, are you? Naughty, trying to get away from me. Oh no, don't explode. No. Oh, that's gonna annoy me. Right, what did I get? What did I get? What did I get? Clay, of course I did. Never mind. Okay, back to it. Uh, um a couple of these ones. They're still bright and Christmassy and stuff. So I'm okay with these ones. And what one have we not used? Let's use that one because it's got some green. Okay, we're getting rid of that, are we? I can't quite see because of that blinking tree, but it'll be fine, it'll be fine. We can change that up when we get to it, but that'll be fine. Do I want it coming down any more than that? I don't think I do. Always best to leave a too wide path because it's very annoying when somebody gets trapped. And do we want it coming? That doesn't leave as much room. Let's put things down and uh, and see how how it goes. Maybe we could have a little. Oh, this is this could be pet corner back here. 
So we've got a pet bed. I hope the house will go next to this, but we'll see. And we've got the pet plushie there. Set him off. And then we've got a hamster cage, so maybe a bamboo bench. I didn't pick it up, that's why I can't find the thing. Uh, right. You can go there. That's adorable. Oh, they've got a little pet corner there. Maybe we could put a little thing across. Just a sort of, you know, little, little area. That's cute and adorable. And then I want here, I guess, the tables and chairs. Now, where are they going to... I want space here. So I'm desk there. See if that's actually enough. Let's put this here. I might have to make a bit more. There you go. It's just like a little little area you can come into. So that's okay. I'll put that there just for now. Just to see how far forward I can get this. That's as far forward as I can get it. Right, and the chair. What well, a teacher's chair actually, uh, table, actually, don't I? Don't, of course I do. you got to get past the teacher to get to the, um, to get to the plushie. There you go. Right, so that's the teacher's desk. And then we want at least two desks, don't we? Hopefully we've got two desks. I think I've got another one in my um in my storage, I think. Yep, yeah, that's it. And hopefully one more here. So yeah, I have I've only got the two um school desks, which is annoying. So I've nicked the one from here. Didn't know you could put things on top of these Zen cushions. But the robot's happy anyway. So yes, I've nicked that. I decided to turn these around so you can still get to the um to the dog section but you have to be you know you have to you have to get past the teacher first. Um I've got loads of school chairs. Loads of them. But never mind. Um right, they're two different colours which is vaguely annoying but that can always be changed at some point. May have to pull these out when I do the house because of his Ah, yes his front door. So if we do them there, move everything along too, that should be okay. Mm, I think I want them together. Just for space really. How's that? That's alright, isn't it? Right, so we've got the school chairs. There are lots of different coloured school chairs, so we'll try and get to the same. So we've got a red one, Oh, and a red one. Ah, that'll do. We shall have those. Then I've got to figure out the path and figure out the um the fencing. Too far. I've also got uh, an essay set or a homework set somewhere. If I can find that in amongst all this. They're being very studious. Right, let's push you out the way. Um, for this, I've got a document stack, so it's like a pile of of essays they're trying to get through. And I'd like a, a laptop, but I'm sure everybody would. I haven't got one yet, so I'll stick a book there instead. Just as good, kids. Just as good. Yeah. Um, so that's that. Back here. We could actually do the other um, bamboo bench moved across a little because 
that's where his door thingy will go. And on here we can put the microscope, if I can find that again. And we could put a portable record player on there. Oh, let's put the uh, let's put the helicopter. Will that go on there? No, you can't put it on there. Oh well. So we've got the microscope there. Put the tin robot on here. That's kind of educational, isn't it? It is now. Oh, I, I haven't. I haven't picked. I didn't pick up my um my thingy. And there's a balloon, and it's like oh oh well. Tin robot and a microscope. All educational things, I'm sure. Why can I never find anything? All the modelling clay, actually. Seriously, where's my microscope gone? Aha! Let's put that there and let's actually put the... Um, don't you tease me. Don't you tease me. Uh, let's put the modelling clay there, I think. Yay! Oh, that, why are you that way around? Oh, I'm sure it's fine. No, it's not. It's annoying me. Why are you that way around? Go this way around. There you go. That's more like it. I want that balloon, but I can't get it. So basically, this is our way in to his house. Oh, but I think that's fine. Um, so we can do a fence across here, maybe, and fit everything in. And then I don't have to make this smaller, and then we've got enough room here. Um... Can I make this one smaller? Just so I can get it across here. Let's have a go. There you go. That'll, that'll do, I think. It will put Raddle's house down now. Oh, no, not, not there. Not there. No. There. Make sure nothing disappears. I think that's alright, isn't it? Yep, there you go. Decision has been made. Nothing disappeared. That's good. That's good. Right. Let's finish this fence now. I can see where the house is. And I think we're going to do a bit of, um... Hmm. Yeah, we'll do a bit of, uh landscaping I guess around here as well seeing that snowman's there we might as well use it right there you go I think I think I'm happy I think I am we've got a little pet corner we've got the teacher's desk and here's for the students to sit and learn got a water cooler because you've got to keep hydrated we've got adventure music going on because schooling is an adventure Absolutely, you've got this guy. <laughs> oh, he amuses me every time. And then over here, need to fix this. We do have um, the sandbox still. Don't know if I can fit that somewhere. But that's a shame. Is it weird to have it indoors? Hmm. Tell you what, we can put here though. See if I can find it. There we go. That's what you want. Right, so now I need to fix the path. I don't know if this is too much, just too much primary colours. Um, I could always just do it around the school area and then not elsewhere. I want to get another path that is, because I essentially want at least two different types of path. One that is more sedate anyway. So maybe we'll you just use this around the school area because it is a bit much is a little bit much just a tad this one's nice but there's no other bits to it and I've got I've got room enough for another path so I may go path searching at some stage well that was completely the wrong one wasn't it um that one there you go and I want that one there so 
Yeah, I think a bit of a terraforming is in order. Well, that'll do for a start anyway. We've got an incredibly loud fountain. I want to change this because it's really nice, but the edge, it just looks a bit weird, but I want something a bit more sedate running up here. So I need to look for a one wide path that works, you know, on its own. But I'm happy enough with all this, I think. We've got lots of toys and stuff for the kids. We've got a little teddy bear's picnic going on. We've got little Benjamin there. I think he'll be happy when he comes outside. And then Raddle's got his science room with a little petting corner there. And a hamster and a little puppy. How they're keeping a puppy in a school will just not question the ethics of that. Because it's, uh, it's um, Animal Crossing and everything's fine. Everything's fine. <sighs> anyway, so we've got this leading around here. I might change this as well. We'll see if I can get some nice stepping stones because I do really like these, but they do look a bit odd with the snow. So I want to get something else, I think, but that will do me. We can have another path stretching off across here and behind our water over here. But for now, if we go and stand here, it's, it's decorated. <laughs> we just don't look at the map and the rest of it that's really empty and oh my lord, I've got to fill all that. <sighs> It'll be exciting. Look at that snowman up there. God, he's terrifying. But anyway, I'm leaving it there. That took ages. Thank you very much for watching. Oh, the bloke stopped playing his music as well at some point. Did I notice that earlier? I really don't know. Anyway, thank you for watching if you stayed this long. But um, please like and subscribe and all of that business would be awesome of you. Thank you very much. But I will see you next time for whatever we get up to. Bye.